Hi, Amy again. Okay, so I'm in Atlanta, Georgia, and as you can see, this is my first video that I'm doing outside because it's such a beautiful day, and uh, it's quiet. You can hear the sounds of nature. You know, in manifesting, they talk about getting in tune with nature, and I want to talk about this one important technique that seems really simple that people just don't think much of, but if you're stuck on something, if you don't know what to do, if you've been at home doing techniques and, and processes and journaling and trying to figure things out and you just feel mentally stuck, go outside, get in your car, get on the subway, wherever you are, go out into the world. It doesn't matter what you do. Go for a drive. Go to a coffee shop. Go grocery shopping. Go visit somebody. Take a walk. It doesn't make a difference what you do. The reason this is important is because when we're in movement, the mind settles down a little bit more. So when I recommend to go out, try and do something that you don't normally do as a routine because if you're doing something as a routine, your mind might actually just go on autopilot and go back to thinking. But if you enjoy it or if it's new, your mind will have to stop and focus, which will start to break up all of that, those thoughts that you're having that you seem to be stuck on. It doesn't take much effort at all. Go out for five minutes, ten minutes. Go look at a tree. Go look at the, the grass. You know, there's this cat over here. I'm staying um, in Atlanta at my cousin's, and there's this cat over here that just comes out on the front porch. It's a stray cat. And I just come out and, like, look at it, and it, it breaks up that thinking of, I have to figure this out, and I have to know what to do, and how is this going to happen, and why am I not getting what I want, and what am I resisting? You know, so there's a lot of practical tips that can really help you in manifesting. It doesn't have to be all spiritual based. It doesn't have to be all mental or emotional based. Like, you can move into the physical world. I do it all the time just to help you release resistance. Yes, you might actually come home and just restart all that resistance again. But you will have had relief. And it's worth it just to get out and to see something different. Just do something different. Anyway, that's my recommendation, my tip of the day for manifesting. Happy manifesting, and good luck.